The debate over the national motto, In God We Trust, is coming to the Tennessee State Capitol. Tomorrow, lawmakers in both chambers will discuss placing some type of sign honoring that motto at the Capitol. And that's where Fox 17 Sky Arnold joins us live with the rest of this story. Sky? Well, Stacey, as of now, there's no definitive plan where they're going to put this sign, but the thought is it could go. Some would like to see it behind these doors here in the tunnel that leads from the state capitol over to Legislative Plaza across the street. Now, the bill sponsor says this is something that should have been proposed a long time ago because here at Tennessee we already have signs honoring agriculture commerce as the state's motto. Every day, lawmakers, state employees, and even lobbyists use this tunnel to get from the Capitol to Legislative Plaza. As you can see, other than a few pictures, there really isn't much to look at. If our state mottos here at the Capitol, our national motto ought to be here as well. State Representative Mike Sparks hopes to change that by putting some type of sign of the nation's motto, In God We Trust, here. I don't really think it's being religious, it's just the historical significance. I'm a big history buff. Historically speaking, In God We Trust has only been the national motto since 1956, though it has been used on coins since the 1860s. We asked the local chapter of Americans United for separation of church and state they had any concerns with the proposed change. It's not terribly serious, but when you view it along with all the other bills that are in the legislature that are all promoting religion, then it's something that we need to worry about. Charles Sumner says the legislature has put out a total of 30 bills this year that deal with church and state relationships, including this one Representative Sparks says should have been proposed a long time ago. I think if anybody complains about this, I think they're really stretching it to find a complaint. There's too many other things that out there that, that need complain about. Now, the cost to put up this sign is estimated at $7,500, but you won't be paying for it. Representative Sparks is planning, if the bill passes, to raise that money privately. Also, we should mention his bill's number is 1776. It's coincidentally, he says, but appropriate. We're live at the state capitol. Sky on with Fox 17 News.